Hey friends, welcome to another product review. We got this Cafe Coffee Bean Grinder. And there it is. It's just this little stainless steel guy. It's got a grinding uh, blade in there and you put your gr uh, beans in there and then press the button. So this is, won't it won't uh, turn on unless you have the little cap there. So that just kind of uh, keeps your coffee grinds from going all over the place, of course. And then when you're done, you just dump it out into your filter or your coffee basket or your um, Keurig cups or whatever. So, um, yeah, this one works pretty good, actually, you guys, and we're just going to go do a demonstration right now. Um, nothing like fresh ground coffee. It smells amazing. It's like the first thing in the morning. You put your beans in there. You grind them. It fills the air with that just fresh ground coffee smell. It's uh, pretty hard to replicate anything like that. It just kind of wakes you up in the morning like you're breathing in caffeine. All right, let's go test it out. We'll show you guys how this works, my friends. All right, friends, so just take some of your uh, coffee beans here and pour them into right about level with that uh, stainless steel top there. Okay, that smells good already. I'll put this on there and just press the button. Poor little coffee bean. Don't even stand a chance. Okay, and then you can grind it as fine as you want. I mean, it does a pretty good job, but it looks pretty fine there. Okay. And then. Dun, dun, dun. Guess if you're not careful, the powder can. It's kind of like static, um, it's attracted by a static. Electricity, I believe. So look at that. It's got the look at that. It's clean. It's attacking me. Okay. So there you have it. And then you can just uh, dump it in your jar, or if you have a filter that has kind of a little pour area here. And oh no, we're having trouble. All right. Maybe you need a little funnel there. I guess if you're uh, putting it into your coffee filter, it wouldn't be an issue, but. And then you can just grind up however much you want. So if you know like how much you need to make, um, then once you get it figured out, then you can just put that many beans in there and then just put it directly into your coffee filter for like the most effective. But you can see like it likes to stick in there. So it does, um, I believe it comes with this little brush, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. It comes with this little brush and you can kind of get your, coffee grounds out there. Not like the coffee grounds are going to uh, go bad or anything and cause uh, get all moldy. If there's like no moisture, I don't think there's any issue with uh, um, this getting dirty or anything like that. So, oops. It does like, it's almost like a, it's electrically charged now. So it likes to hide in there. But um, yeah. So I would recommend instead of having it here so it stores your coffee, um, just figure out how much you need for your cup if you do a certain amount every day, like 10 cups of coffee, like how many beans do you need or where do you fill it up to to get that amount and then you can just put it right into your filter or have a wider jar here or a funnel for your coffee grounds. That works as well. Okay, guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day. See you next time.